In this video, I'll show you how to set up a buy two, get one free offer in WooCommerce in just a few simple steps. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. Okay, so the first step is to head over to WooSuite.com. Go ahead and download the dynamic pricing and discount rules plugin. Once you've done so, let's head back over to our dashboard. I'll leave the link in the description below. Okay, so here we are in our WordPress dashboard. Assuming you've downloaded the dynamic pricing and discount rules plugin, you want to, the second step is to go ahead and upload this plugin. So you want to navigate to plugins, add new, go ahead and upload and install the file in which you just downloaded. Once you've done so, you'll see this WooSuite menu here. Activate your license key and then go ahead and activate the dynamic pricing and discount rules plugin from the add-ons section here. You just want to scroll down and go ahead and install and activate the dynamic pricing and discount rules plugin. Go ahead and toggle this to on and then we can just go ahead and click manage here or you can click the dynamic pricing and discount rules from the sidebar here. Okay, so the third step is to go ahead and create our two for one offer and to do so we'll navigate to advanced rules. So we have two options in creating this rule. So we can create it on a global level or we can create it on a product level. Okay, so I'm gonna start with configuring it on a global level and then we'll go ahead and configure it on a product, product level as well, just to show you what that looks like. Okay, so we'll click add category pricing. Okay, and then we just wanna give this a name and it's for internal purposes only. So when you have multiple promotional offers running at a time, so you know exactly what each rule's doing. Okay, so I'm just going to name mine two for one. Okay, so where it says quantities based on, I'm going to set this to line item. Okay, and then where it says categories to count, so this is what's going to trigger this promotional offer. And I'm running mine in solely in the accessories category. So I'm going to say a user needs to purchase a item in the accessories category. And then here where it says categories to adjust, we're going to apply the discount to the accessories category also. So I select accessories category here. And then here where it says apply to, we get to choose who we want this rule to apply to. So we can choose from everyone, guest users, which are logged out users, a specific user role or a specific user. I'm gonna select everyone for now. So we have the option as well to set this rule to apply to first time buyers only. So you just go ahead and enable this option here. I'm gonna leave it disabled for now. Where it says rule processing mode, I'm gonna go ahead and select special offer here. For this coupon section, I'm going to skip this for now, but essentially what you could do is once you finish setting up this promotional offer, you can create a coupon to trigger this promotional offer so you can set it. So you can send specific users a exclusive coupon that will give them access to this offer. Okay, so I'm going to leave this coupon section for now. And then here where it says dates, you have the option as well to schedule this promotional offer to run within a given time period. Again, I'm going to leave this to blank. Okay, so where it says purchase, how many items does a user needs to purchase? So we'll say that user needs to purchase two item and then we'll give them one free. Okay, so it's buy two and get one free. Okay, so the user purchased two and then they'll receive one at a percentage discount of 100%, meaning they're getting the third item for free. Okay, and here where it says repeating it, so do we wanna set this particular rule to repeat? In my case, no, we wanna only um, run this rule once for each users. So I'm gonna select no here, and then I'm just gonna save changes, and then we can test out this rule. Okay, so let's refresh this page. All right, so let's add to item. Okay, so as you can see for the two items, we're paying full price. But now if we add a third item to cart, let's add this one. You can see we're still paying $40 for all three items. And here you can see we're getting the third one for free. So that's how we would create a buy two, get one offer. I've also created a few other videos showing you how to create a buy one get one free offer and a few other promotional offers as well. So now let me show you how you'd go ahead and create a similar setup on a product basis. Okay, so first I'm going to go ahead and remove this offer. And then now I'm going to create a new promotional offer on this belt product here. So let's go ahead and click edit product. Okay, and then on the product data here, we should see a new tab which says pricing discount rules. So we'll click add a pricing group. And similar to on a global level, we get to choose who we want this rule to apply to. So I'm going to select everyone, first time buyer, no. 
um, quantities based on um, the product quantity. And then for the rule processing mode, I'm going to select special offer here. So it's exactly the same as on the global level. So the user needs to purchase two items and they'll receive one item for free. So let's update this product. Okay. Now let's view product. Let's clear our basket. Okay. And let's add free products to cart. Here you can see that we're getting all free items for 40 pounds instead of 60 pounds. And that's how you create a buy two, get one free offer in WooCommerce in just a few simple steps. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe for more videos like this. And if you've got any questions, leave them in the comment box below or reach out to support and we'll get back to you as soon as possible.